Good day, YouTubers. This short video is just my solution for retaining the original bowsprit on my boat when I moved to putting an anchor winch in it. Short and sweet, get straight into it, and I'll talk about it again after the main action. Watching my channel for a little while, you might have remember seeing this. It's getting quite rusty now. I put it on as a guard for the anchor when it comes up so it doesn't flip out of the bowsprit because I didn't get a bowsprit specifically for the anchor winch, I just used the one that was on the baseboard and it did need something like this just to stop the anchor flipping out. And I thought I'd picked up some stainless steel out of the scrap heap, but it turns out it wasn't because it's gone all rusty. So this time I have certainly got some 316 stainless steel because I had it marked with a felt pen what it was. I've cut it to length, cut it to width, drilled a couple of holes in it and I bent it around a piece of pipe like that it can be bent by hand, it's only 2mm stainless steel so it wasn't hard to bend by hand and I'm going to put that on in its place that'll do the same job and it will look a lot better no more rust stains as you can see it was really easy to make just need a little bit of stainless steel a hand drill will do for drilling the holes and something to bend it round. It attaches to the boat on my bowsprit at least using the existing holes that were there and the existing bolts that were there. I just had to undo them and slip this in and do the bolts up again. The reason I have it at all is that when I first put my anchor winch on, I found that one time I took the anchor up over the nose just slightly too fast and it jumped out of the bowsprit. This stops it doing that. It's a really cheap, simple solution. Don't need to buy a special bowsprit just because you've got an electric winch. That's it for the video. Until next time, good fishing.